if you're seeing me right now, then you need to start listening to yourself. I feel like there's, you know, a lot of opinions out there. There's a lot of everything out there. But you must start listening to what's inside of you. You must start creating your own reality, your own opinions of things, rather than always seeking validation from external sources. And listen, let's talk about it. Let's talk about that person that you keep thinking about. Ask yourself, am I thinking about this person because I'm still emotionally attached to that person in a negative way? Is there a trauma bond involved? What happened there? Did that person reject me and I'm seeking that validation from them that I am worthy rather than giving yourself the validation that you are worthy? Because maybe, of course, you're worthy, okay? Um, or is it because you genuinely, genuinely love that person? Is it because you genuinely believe that this person is good, that this person can show you a good side to themselves photo ones on the bottom of the deck okay reunion right spirit team what's going on here i feel like there's a deeper message here i feel like this it's almost like spirit needs you to open your eyes yeah five of wands so much conflict so much heartbreak listen i want to remind you why you broke up with that person in the first place i want you to think back over that connection over that relationship how that person treated you more specifically and the thing is it's always important to reflect on your own actions in the connection, but there's a sense of you needing to really look at this person's actions and how they made you feel during this whole connection. And whether that's the way that you want to feel moving forward, is that the way that you expect to be treated by somebody who is supposedly, who supposedly loves you? Um, okay. Six of Wands, Four of Wands. Listen, if you want a reunion here, you can manifest a reunion, okay? It's all about becoming rudely interrupted. But yeah, if you want a reunion here, you can create a reunion, okay? Oh, see, throat chakra. I don't think I don't think Spirit wants me to say that to you. Um I I wanna say a reunion with this person is not the right thing for you. I want you to look back on this connection. And identify how much you've lost yourself in that connection, how much you weren't the real you. Perhaps this person brought out the worst in you. Whereas you have so much to give. And I feel like this person may have really made you doubt love or what a real beautiful connection looks like and feels like. I want to say this person created a monster. Wow, that's powerful. I feel like when you were with this person or maybe more so towards the end of that connection you became a version of yourself that you never want to see again so why would you want this person back why would you want that version of yourself back and i know you're probably thinking yeah but i've changed yeah but i've healed but is that person not just going to bring back that old version of you because remember both of you need to heal that person needs to heal as well because that person triggered that in you for a reason um, a lot of wand energy coming forward, fire sign energy, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Um, this also speaks of passion. I get the sense that you are a very passionate person, very creative as well. I feel like right now, it's time for you to use your creativity for like a higher good, for a bigger purpose. Three, four, three, four five other time. Oh, wow. Okay. What's going on? Yeah. Listen this person betrayed you okay this person took from you this person could have taken money from you this person could have um really betrayed you sabotaged you and all you did was give all you did was give 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 to this person baby baby i really need you to to think about this think about whether you truly want this person in your life i believe you have outgrown that connection that person and i know your your heart is holding on and listen it may be that your heart is holding on to, to the higher version of this person, their higher self. But that higher self, they need to be the ones to unlock that. And you can't live in hope that that person will come out at some point. Keep moving forward with your life. Keep doing you. And keep remembering who you are. You are so goddamn special. You have so much to, uh, so much to give. The future is very bright for you. But this person, you're allowing this person to sabotage you, even without them being present in your life. Check yourself. I love you.